unfortunately, there's a lot of background noise. They're doing some crane stuff over there at the big farm. But, we got this going on. So, first off, I'm over here at my grandmother and grandfather's grave, their headstone. And I am going to take out my uh, EMF and just kind of see if I can get some readings. I have my laser, unfortunately, that's going to be pretty useless, but let's turn that on. Is there anybody here right now? No? Well, spike to three. Well, it's, I mean, it's back down to nothing. Do you recognize me? It's a little chilly out here. It's windy, too. If you recognize me, you see this device in my hand? If you get near it, it'll blink, and it'll let me know that you're near me. It's sitting at a one. And keep, again, keep in mind, there's no... I mean, those are like the nearest telephone poles over there, but there's nothing electronic out here. And, I mean, this isn't... It's going off on my phone right there. It's not going off at my GoPro. But over here, it is blinking, and this is... This is where they're buried. This is where my nano's buried, right here. I'm not feeling anything. It's hard to feel like chills and stuff when it's actually just kind of cold. <laughs> Alright, let's turn that off. I am going to take out an app on my phone. And we're going to take the ghost tube app with a grain of salt. Uh, you know. You should be able to manipulate the energies and find words. And use those words to communicate with me. Night. Oh, come back at night? You think it'd be better if I came back at night? Well, I agree with that. Unfortunately, I'm not sure if I'm allowed to come back at night. I would love to come back at night, but I think I might get... They will harm you. Oh, if I come back at night, they're going to harm me? Who? I don't think there's anybody bad here. I think everybody who passed away and is buried here are probably nice people. Can you tell me who would harm me? Can you tell me why they would harm me? This is interesting. Lloyd Clifford Smith died on my birthday, exactly my birthday, December 13th, 1993. If there's a Lloyd Clifford Smith here, you died the same day I was born. I find that really interesting. There is no peace. No peace? No peace in the afterlife? You sure about that? Who's this? Leland Cram? Died 1895. What is this? This is a... Is this headstone way over here? There is no peace. Okay, you said that twice. Jeez. You know, I have a problem with existentialism. And you saying there is no peace twice in a row kind of freaks me out a little bit. You know? Can you tell me about the afterlife? If there's no peace, then what is there? I'm gonna look for you, Carl. Let's see if I can... Well, here's Charles. That's pretty close. I just passed a Charles. Did you get that wrong? Did you choose the wrong word? Okay, damn. That is just a straight up five. Charles, is that you? Hi Charles, my name is Chris. Is there something you want to say to me? Just keep
keeps spiking to a 5. It's just still going at a 5, which makes me not want to believe that that's anything. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and sync record on this. And 1. Charles, how you doing today, buddy? What a way to introduce myself to a ghost. Do you, did you also go by Carl? Is that your nickname? Was that your wife's name for you? If you have anything you want to say to me, this little device in my left hand right here, hand right here, hand right here, made this little device in my left hand right here. If you want to speak into it, nice and loud, shout it into this device, and I'll be able to hear you. Just wait for the wind to stop, okay? Now is your time to talk, it's nice and quiet. I'm going to set this on top of your headstone, okay? Right on the headstone. And if you're here, I want you to say something into that device, right there on top of the headstone. Go ahead and say something into it. quick before the wind comes back. Say anything, just shout it. As loud as you can. Oh. You fell over. Holy shit, really? Well, yeah, you're right, grandmother. That's, uh, that's you. Do you know your name? Can you tell me your name? The first word out of this, this my preferred ghost app, ghost tube, is grandmother. <laughs> that's insane. Boys, now we got some evidence. If you are my grandmother, what's my name? Or what's your name? Revolting. Revolting, okay. Oh, uh, maybe those people see me and they're a bit revolted that I'm. they can tell them over here doing this. Can you give me a name of somebody in my family? Somebody that you know? Somebody close to me? Because we don't get names in this device very often. That car's still there. Flashlight. Flashlight? No, this thing on top of my um, camera is not a flashlight. It's actually a laser grid. It, it doesn't really work much during the day. I mean, it's a really bright laser, but it's not going to be that useful for, for this. I'm going to drop my camera a little bit. Okay, it looks like that car is leaving now. Okay, Nana. I'm going to walk away, okay? I'm going to go to the other side of the cemetery and see if anybody there wants to talk. Okay? Over here. No, you want me to stay over here? Well, I want to stay over here, but I also need to go to the other side. There's so much more cemetery left, you know? I'll be back, though. I'm going to walk over there, and then I'll come back. Don't worry. I won't leave you. Over here. Over here? You really want me to stay over here? I'm gonna go over there. But I will be back, I promise. Okay? I'm gonna leave my bag right there. Gonna be right in the sun, too. I've been in the shade this whole time. 
down. Down. Oh yeah, there's a dip coming up. There's a bit of a dip right there, going down. Hopefully it's nice and dry over here. Is there anybody here that wants to talk? Anybody looking for company? Everyone over here, my name is Chris. There's another car coming. Definitely a lot of activity. Everyone's just very quiet. What is this? This is an EMF. And I swear I just saw something right here. I just saw something like Wish right here. Um, this is an EMF, an electromagnetic field detector. Okay? Basically, if you get near it, it'll make it spike up like that. See how it's turning red? That means some, somebody's really close. Now it's down to one. Don't be scared. That's just a car. There you go. See? Everything's okay. You can walk right up to it and you can touch this in my hand and you'll make it you'll make it change colors. This is an EVP. And you could talk into this. And you could talk into this. And you could talk into this. If you talk real loud, if you shout into this, I'll be able to play back and hear you. Can you tell me your name? Can you tell me how you died? Are you happy where you are? Am I dead? I'm sorry to be the one to tell you this, but yes, you are dead. Unfortunately, you are passed away. Do you know who you are? Can you tell me your name? Do you remember your name? Everyone got so quiet. Give it another minute, I'm gonna go back to my, my Nana's grave. And then probably pack up and head out. Been here doing this almost an hour. Stay with me. No, you want me to stay with you? I have to go soon though. People driving by looking at me. Who wants me to stay with them? What's your name? That's mine. Which one? This one? I'm really close to this one. It's hard to read it though. Yeah, school bus going by again. 1907. I think the school bus was empty. Is there anybody forgotten over here way in the corner? Some of these look very old. Died 1757. That one over there, Joseph Hoyt. Wow. That's 
got nothing on it. Looks like a little field or marsh over there. Does it say 1831 down at the bottom? You shouldn't be here. Oh, I shouldn't? I'm sorry. I'm not here to disrespect you. Whoever's speaking, I'm just here to, to talk. My name is Chris. I'm just walking around trying to hear what some of you might have to say. This is my place. This is yours, yeah. This is a very far away corner of the cemetery that I don't think many people visit. I'm not trying to impede on your place. And if I am, please tell me to leave now. If you don't want me to be here, tell me to leave, and I will. Hello. Hello. I am going to leave, okay? I'm going to get back in my car, and I'm going to head home. All right, while I pack up my stuff, I'm going to set this right here. Heart attack. Heart attack? Man, I've been worried about a heart attack. Don't go saying that. I'm doing everything I can to take care of my heart and my health. I'm the healthiest I've ever been. Nine. Nine. I don't know what nine would mean. A heart attack in nine days? Because I hope not. That would be upsetting. All right, Nana, Grandpa, and everyone else, I'm saying goodbye. You know, it's funny, because I always go to say, I hope you all have a good day or something, but, like, you know, I just, I hope you're at peace, you know? Boat. Boat.